Have you been trying figuring out what the best setup for your travel is while still keeping it light and compact? In today's video we are going to be talking about my minimalist camera setup. I built a setup which fits perfectly in a 9 liter sling bag. It's just the right setup for a small weekend trip. Alright guys, the camera of choice is the Fujifilm X100V. Because of its size and weight this camera definitely earns a place in my bag. Last video I was diving a bit deeper into the reason why I think this camera is so great for what I need it for. So I won't repeat it in this video but you are more than welcome to check it out later. I will put the link in the description below. For headphones I'm still using the AirPods second generation. It does connect to my iPhone very quick. You simply just have to put it in your ears and that's it. So the tripod I'm using is the Manfrotto Pixie Evo. It's very quick and easy to attach. The only downside is when the legs are not fully open because you want to set the tripod a bit higher it will slide down because the leg has no proper grip on it but in the end using it as a table tripod or a selfie stick works just fine. When I'm out I like to bring a water bottle with me so I've been testing out the Mimo bottle. I chose the size A6, it can hold up to 12 ounces or for us in Europe 375 milliliter of water. Because of the flat design you can easily fit it in your sling bag. I was searching for an affordable alternative to an iPad and came across this tablet. This is the Xiaomi Pad 5. There is a big difference in price when comparing this to an iPad. It's half the price of an iPad. I paid around 360 euros. I needed something to firstly edit my photos on the go so I don't need to bring my MacBook with me and secondly to back up my SD card on an external SSD. Therefore having a tablet is great. This tablet has a 120Hz 11 inch LCD display, 6GB of RAM, 128GB of internal storage, 4 Dolby Atmos speakers and it supports 33W fast charging. The editing software I'm using is Lightroom and it works perfectly fine on this device. Having a pen does help when you edit your photos. This one is from Amazon and works great without noticing any delay. For backing up the SD card you need A an adapter and B a external SSD. The adapter I'm using is also from Amazon. It has 3 USB slot divided in 2 USB A and 1 USB type C. You also get a slot for an SD card and a micro SD. For backup I'm using the Samsung T7 portable SSD. It's super light and can hold up to 1TB of storage. For powering all my gear I have the Anker 737 120W charger. It allows me to charge 3 devices at once. It has a total of 3 USB slots divided in 2 USB type C and 1 USB type A. To carry everything I mentioned I'm using the Bellroy Venture 9 liter sling. It has plenty of organizations. In the front you find 2 mesh pockets and also a key clip. In the main compartment there is a pocket for your sunglasses. You have one pocket with a zipper and four open pockets. On each side of the bag you get a stretchy mesh pocket perfectly to fit lenses or other stuff in there. So all in all it's a very great bag with plenty of organization options. And even though this bag can hold up so much stuff it doesn't really look that chunky on you. So the next product I will be talking about is the Hero Clip. Sometimes you will be in a situation where you don't want to put your bag on the floor. So the cool thing about this clip is it extends out and turn into a hook. So whether you are in a restaurant or in the bathroom, you are now able to hang your bag away from the floor. It's a very useful tool and I'm really enjoying using it. So that's it for today's video. If you made it this far, I really appreciate it.